Stephanie Smith, DuPont Pioneer Field Agronomist here in Tipton, Indiana today. And I wanted to talk a little bit about the topic of plant density. So here, uh, we did a plant de density study looking at 55,000 plants an acre versus 35,000 plants an acre. This side of the plot, we're at 55,000 plants an acre, and we can see light interception to the soil surface here is, is minimal. So we're capturing all that sunlight and we have canopy closure. For Tipton, an average planting population would be about 35,000 plants an acre. And we can see how the light reaching the soil surface in this plot is increased. So essentially that light reaching soil surface is missed energy and, and missed opportunity on yield. And I really wanted to take a video of this plot to show the height difference um, between these two populations. So we know that a plant growing within six inches of another plant will create a competitive response. That competitive response is to grow taller to reach more sunlight for interception for, for photosynthesis. And in this plot, so again, on the left we have 35,000 plants an acre, and on the right we have 55,000 plants an acre, and we can see that the 55,000 plants an acre is about a foot taller than the 35,000. Essentially, we're increasing lignin um, within the stem, and you know we're growing taller, and we're just what that pl plant is trying to do is just capture more photosynthesis. You know, in terms of standability, end of season, that increased height added with ear weight can create an issue, and we'll just continue to monitor this plot throughout the season. But the reason it's growing taller is it isn't a competitive response. You know, plant spacing is less than six inches in the 55,000 plants an acre, while in 35, we're very close to that six inch spread.